Hello friends and welcome to another video. This may be the comfiest video I've ever filmed, that's for sure. Okay, so today I am showing you my entire loungewear collection, the amazingness that I have built over the year of quarantine and literally living, working, doing life from home, in my comfies, no bra on, hair thrown up just like this, no makeup on my face except maybe the remnants of yesterday's makeup that I don't wash off my face every night. Yeah, I am that person. So I'm gonna share it all with you, my whole collection. I'm so excited. I've curated this beautiful collection. If there's one thing I had absolutely no willpower over through the pandemic, it was swiping my credit card every time I saw a sweatshirt, matching sweatsuit, PJ set. And yes, in the rare times when I went in public, like to the grocery store or the bank or the gas station, you better believe I was wearing and rocking my matching sweatsuits because what else are you supposed to wear in the middle of a freaking pandemic, am I right? But the purpose of today's video is to throw a funeral because unfortunately and fortunately, whichever way you look at it, I've gone back to work in my office in person full time. And that means I have to like get dressed, shower, do my hair, put makeup on, present myself as a real normal functioning high standard human. And I can't wear sweatpants to work. If I could wear sweatpants to work, I think my productivity would definitely go up. But that's a conversation for another time. So before I get started and jump into my very large collection, I want to take one second to say, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel, follow us on all of our socials, find us on Instagram and other places. I don't know. I don't really know how social media works, but I think I have an Instagram account. Okay, I do. I'll link it right here. Link it, LOL. And I just want to say in all seriousness, because I'm a little hyped right now, if you can't tell, it's like 1030. I've had a coffee from Starbucks. I don't do this. So this video is about to get real weird. But I want to take a serious, sincere moment to say my last video that I posted that was kind of a genuine, vulnerable chat about weight loss, weight gain, topics like that. I won't say anything more in case those things could be triggering or sensitive to you. You can definitely go watch that video. I'll link it right here if you're interested in hearing my journey and my story with weight. Um, but I want to say thank you so much because I got such a great response from people. I got so many messages, phone calls, in-person talks with people, just sharing similar stories and very encouraging, very like helpful resources. So I feel really awesome after posting that video and connecting with a lot of you guys. So thank you for your very kind and thoughtful response to that. So without further ado, let's get in to my loungewear collection. I don't know what that was. But first up, we have this beauty. Now this is more of a PJ loungewear. You know, I don't think, I would like wear this to like pop out somewhere real quick. I don't know if I could rock this at the grocery store. I don't know if I would have that much confidence because it's very much PJ style, but I love the V-neck. It is the softest fabric. It's like super light, not too hot, not too fleecy. It's just like a nice throw it on, be so comfy. This one is from one of my very favorite brands to get loungewear from, Sense of Style. You should check it out. It is awesome and this will not be the last Sense of Style get up that you see in this video. Okay, next up, we got a lot to get through people. Okay, next up is an Old Navy fave. This is another kind of more lightweight, not super thick, and warm one. And this is definitely one I would get away with wearing at like the grocery store, out and about. I even like popped into my office to grab a few things a couple times wearing this guy. And I love it. What I love most about this one is that sometimes in my loungewear, I like to size up because if you're just lounging in it, who cares? So it's like super big, super baggy, just like so comfy. You know what I'm saying? Next one. Okay, this next one is a mix and match one. I've got these really cool, like long flowy pant from Target. They have really cool, like long pockets right here too. And then this sweatshirt is from Aerie. I love it because it's super long, but it has nice cutouts at the side. And if you think this is all I have, then just give me a sec. I have it in green too. 
So these green sweatpants are from Gap and they're fabulous. And this is the exact same airy sweatshirt, but in green, because I couldn't decide if I wanted the gray or the green one, so I bought both of them. What I love specifically about these sweatshirts is you can dress them up too. They look great with jeans, tennis shoes. You can like actually look presentable in these, but still be super comfy. Okay, next one. Okay, can we just like pause and take a quick second to recognize that my ponytail just already has a total mind of its own, so sorry. This is another hmm, sense of style sweatsuit. I love this one because it's a waffle material and it's got this cool like ripping detail right here. It's another one. I love to wear this one to the airport, you know, the two times I've visited the airport in the past year and a half because it's really comfy, but it's still kind of put together and matches. You can kind of dress it up, dress it down. You could throw in like a jean jacket and some boots, look real cute, but you could also just like wear it no bra around the house, just lounging. I love this one and I got it in an oatmeal color too. So cute, gotta love it, so comf. Okay, I threw my hair up a little better. I know it was probably driving at least my mother who's definitely watching this crazy, so you're welcome mom. Okay, this is another one, probably my most worn loungewear set. It's from Old Navy. Again, I got this one in a size too big on purpose to be just super comfy and oversized and just, ooh, so snuggly. And this one is lined with fleece, so it's super warm. So this one was my favorite one on like a chilly morning to roll out of bed, throw it on real quick, make my breakfast and go sit at my desk with my space heater on and just like be enveloped in the warmth. I love this one, so good. Next, this one is another kind of pajama leaning sense of style set. Are you noticing the trend yet? But this one is made out of a really, really breathable light but still super soft fabric. I love this one. And it totally gives like the tie dye 2020 vibes when tie dye was super hyped. So I love this one, super fun. I don't really wear it out of the house because again, it's very pajama leaning, but it's so comfy. Okay, next, I've got this very plain and simple t-shirty fabric. One from Sense of Style. <laughs> again, it's like a true jogger set. I love it. It's another one you could totally get away with dressing up, throwing on some accessories, the right shoes and little over thing. You could totally wear it out. I love this gray color. It just feels very cozy. And I also have this one in hot freaking pink. I know this one's kind of over the top. And I think Eric described it perfectly when he said I was giving off strong Elle Woods vibes in this getup when he first saw it. And honestly, I took that as the biggest compliment my husband's ever given me. So win-win, you know what I'm saying? This one's that same t-shirty fabric. I love it. It's so comfy. It's so easy just to throw on and be so relaxed, so chill, but still feel like you're a tiny, tiny bit put together during the day. So this is now that I can't wear it to work and my work jammas are no longer a thing, RIP. This is now like my true weekend wardrobe. Like I'm just rotating through as many of these each weekend as I possibly can. Cause you gotta still get wear out of them. They're fabulous. They're so comfy. I love them so much. Okay, so I think that about wraps it up, especially because I'm getting more hyped by the second and probably starting to be annoying. Sorry, again, coffee. And actually they accidentally added an extra shot. And like I said, it's like 1030, probably 11 o'clock at night at this point, And I am not going to bed anytime soon. What have I done? So anyway, that is my loungewear collection. And I will say that honestly doesn't even scratch the surface because I have probably 20 to 30 more sweatshirts in that closet that I'm too hot and sweaty and hyped to try on for you. So if you'd like to see a part two where I show you my entire sweatshirt collection, and trust me, there are some true gems in that one, then like this video and comment down below. I think that's it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this kind of manic version of me that's up way past her bedtime. I appreciate you all. See you later.